um, is a binomial expansion. Now the, the, the way they've given us the um, bracket, we can't integrate, we can't expand that straight away. We need to have a one here. So in order to divide uh, to get a one there, we're going to need to divide what's in the bracket by two. But we're not really dividing by two, we're dividing by two to the power of minus two. So when I divide by two to the minus two, that two to the minus two needs to come outside the bracket. And two to the minus two is four, uh, a quarter, sorry, one over four. So that is now what we're going to expand. One plus x over two to the minus two. So Hopefully you remember the formula is 1 plus nx, where n is this power, so that's 1 plus minus 2 times x, and in this case x is x over 2, plus minus 2 times minus 3, because it's n times n minus 1, times x squared, all over 2, plus, and we need to go up to x cubed this time, minus 2, times minus 3 times minus 4 x cubed over 2 times 3. So let's try and cancel some stuff down. This 2 here cancels with this 2 here. This 2 here cancels with this 2 here. This 2 and this 2 cancel as does this 3 and this 3. And also, we've got a 2 times 2 times 2 here, so that's going to cancel with this 4 here in a minute. So I won't do that yet, because that's going to look messy. So we have got a quarter of 1 minus, that minus is still there, so 1 minus x. This minus times this minus is positive, so plus 3 x squared over 2 squared, so over 4. Minus, because we've got 3 minuses this time, 4 x cubed over 8, and that 4 over 8 is the same, obviously, as a half. So x cubed over 2. Then need to finally bring that 4 back in, that quarter back in. So that gives us a quarter minus a quarter x plus 3x squared over 16 minus x cubed over 8. And that's my final answer. Oh, I've lost my x there. That's my final answer. It also asks us to state the set of values uh, for which this expansion is valid. So this expansion is valid when this x, this term here is between minus 1 and 1. So it's valid when we had x minus 2, x over 2, not that equal to, x over 2 is less than 1 but more than minus 1. This isn't acceptable, we have to write down when x is valid. So if we double both sides, that tells us it's valid between minus 2 and 2.